Welcome to our live broadcast from Huainan City, East China's Anhui Province. I am Yuki Yang with Xinhua News Agency. There are a lot of solar electric systems installed on the water. Enjoy the view from our drone. We can see our drone is moving now. What we can see now is a lake with a water area of 400 hectares in Nihe Tang, Panji District, Huainan City. It is not an ordinary lake though, as it is formed after cave-in of coal mining areas. You guys may know, Huainan City has many coal mining ventures. There are many ponds due to many years' development of coal mining industries in Huainan City. This solar pumps has a combined capacity of 14 megawatts, one of the largest in the world. It is quite common that solar panels are installed on land, for example, in the desert. As a matter of fact, they can now be installed on water now. We can see lots of photovoltaic panels now. Our drone is moving now. There are more than 120,000 solar power panels over this water pond. Those power converters are not fixed to the water surface. Instead, they are installed on a grey floating structure which is supported under the water by more than a thousand engineering columns made of reinforced concrete. We can see some duckweeds now. What a spectacular scene. But actually, the weather is not good today. If the weather is better, I think the scene is better. Now you can see the solar power panels clearly. Our drone is moving. I think many people have questions about those solar power panels. It is beautiful, isn't it? Some people are confused about the project.
the first step of the project is to design and locate the accurate position of every engineering columns using GPS. We set the diameter and the length of engineering columns according to the actual condition under the water and the weight of floating structure. Meanwhile, as the project is built and operated on the water, the important factors for consideration in the engineering plan are the wind scale, wind speed, and whether there will be any rain. As you know, different weather conditions require different engineering designs. It's beautiful. Now our drone comes back. We still can see those solar panels clearly. Some people ask, why are we building these solar photovoltaic power stations on the water ponds? Because local authorities want to make full use of the water area to save the land. Also, the cooling effects from water on photovoltaic modules and cables can improve the efficiency of generating electricity for the sake of green development. Now our drone comes back now. It is descending now. Thank you for being with us. See you next time.